Hello and welcome to Epic Street. Today we're going to be taking a look at Litecoin and the opportunity it presents. But before we actually dive deep into the technicals, make sure to hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel to stay up to the hardest trend in the cryptocurrency market. Also give us a follow on Twitter at FXS Crypto. So back to Litecoin. Litecoin seems to be like ever since this uh, December 4th drop, right? It's It's been on a downtrend. Although I did try to establish an uptrend here between 2nd, 3rd Feb and 10th Feb, it fell short uh, because this resistance level here, declining trend line, served as a resistance level and price was rejected here again. But as a result of this rejection here, uh, we seem to be forming a an inverse head and shoulders pattern, whereas this, this is the shoulder, left shoulder, right shoulder, and this is the head. So, uh, Theoretically speaking, uh, the, the target for this inverse head and shoulder pattern is measured from the right peak of the shoulder to the bottom of the head, and you add it to the, the breakout point, right? So far, the theoretical target predicts that it's going to be a 26% upswing. Uh, assuming we get some something like this happen here, breakout is going to be somewhere around here, which is anywhere between 135 to 140. Basically, anything between 130 to 140 is where I'm expecting the breakout to occur. Right, so if, if you measure this target here from this particular point at 137, you get a target of 174, so roughly 175. And the, so sometimes these uh, patterns do not tend to go according to the breakout, but the reason why I believe this is gonna happen is because the, the major resistance level ends at 165, so we might see some sort of a consolidation once we break out around 165. But uh, I eventually see Litecoin reaching this 165 level and hitting 175, mainly because of this massive fair value gap here that exists from 166 to 202. So, so once we clear 165, I believe uh, it's, it's pretty easy it's going to be a pretty easy path for Litecoin to head to the $200 level, right? But before we actually talk about the before before we before I end this, I also want to mention about this particular downswing that I just uh, marked out here, right? As you can see, there's an equal, almost an equal low being formed around 120. So I believe this is going to be swept. And as you can see here, this was a major resistance for Litecoin before it actually broke out on 4th Feb and moved higher, right? So this level hasn't been touched since flipping it. So I believe we're gonna get a sweep of this equal lows over here at 120. And then probably if we're lucky, we're gonna get a retest of 417, uh, which would be a good place to position long. So basically, uh, if we do get a retest of 117, this run up up to 165 would be a good 40% upswing. But if it doesn't, and Litecoin starts reversing around 120, this would still be a 37% upswing. That is assuming that Litecoin kind of forms a local top at 165 and it doesn't go all the way up to 174. Regardless, I think things are looking pretty good for Litecoin. So again, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.